morning guys it is a day three of our trip to Moab and we are just waking up and packing at Lower O'Brien campground it is nine o'clock in the morning we're almost packed up but we woke up and it is a little bit on a cooler side slightly above zero as we got out of the tent it wasn't too bad but right now you can feel the crisp air the sun is just peeking through, uh, over the mountains in front of me. We will pack up and hit the road. Hopefully it's gonna warm up, probably it will, and later we'll be complaining that it's too warm. The guys are working hard here. I'm slacking off. <laughs> Christian, almost ready to go.
just a heartbeat away Still another life Have we let it slip away? passes and the highest elevation uh, I've seen or I was able to catch was uh, 7,400 feet now we are descending as we are very close to craters of the moon the national monument pretty soon it will be time to pull over and drop the layers so it is warm now Temperature 23 degrees. There's all the lava. Now I'll be riding through here for quite some time. And it is a national monument. of the moon lava on both sides but I don't think that we'll be going a visitor center because uh, we were here before it's just a coincidence that we are actually crossing through here and uh, there's some of us that didn't see it but they can see probably as much around here on the side of the road 
then uh, they could see actually right when you get to the visitor center. crossing I-15 that was uh, over an hour of uh, riding through similar stuff as here except there was uh, quite a few towns uh, in between my friends carried on across I-15 and they're gonna cut through a section of Wyoming and uh, we I separated I went on I-15 and I will get into Salt Lake City then to Moab from there. I didn't want it to go that way because I did that uh, two years ago when I went to Moab. So I figure I-15 is gonna be a quicker for me. I don't want to ride through there. So from this point, I have uh, 427 miles to Moab. It will be a smooth gliding on the interstate for a little bit. Uh, we spent uh, almost two and a half days riding the secondary highways and roads. I don't mind hitting the interstate for a little, little bit. And most likely by the time I hit uh, Salt Lake City, there shouldn't be much traffic in there. Uh, because that will be getting close to the evening hours. Plus it is a Sunday. I love riding through states.